you get mentioned in my name. We don't like what you say. I don't give a fuck. Y'all can suck my dick. Hey guys, Evan Tan here. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to use Dropify to fulfill your orders in from AliExpress. Okay, so this is assuming that you have linked the products, you know, from AliExpress using Dropify into your Shopify store. All right, it only works this way. All right, so over here, I've created you know a mock order, you know, for demonstration purposes. All right, so because you know we use the CSV method, you know, in all of our stores, so unfortunately, we aren't able to demonstrate you guys, you know, a live order all right so dropify we used to use it really really long ago but right now we all use csv web method which is way quicker all right so for those who have just starting out and are using dropify to fulfill all your orders this is the way to go all right okay so once the orders come in right it will come onto your dropify you know panel you know under orders right so let's say over here you know evan time you know you just place an order of this ultimate fruit slicer for example right so Assuming that everything is cool and all good to go, you know, all you need to do is to click this place order, you know, have yourself or a VA to do this day in, day out, right? This is very, very time consuming, assuming that you have a lot of orders every day. Okay, so let's go ahead and see how the Dropify one click fulfillment works. Okay, maybe not one click, maybe just a few clicks, and I'll show you how it works in a quickly. All right, so just go ahead, you know, once an order comes in, you know, you just have to uh, click this and place order. All right, just click on order all. Okay, and let the magic happen. All right, so all right, see, both my hands are actually off the mouse, and I do not have to click anything. So actually, by linking, you know, this product, you know, Dropify will right away know how many orders of this specific products. You need to do all right it automatically chooses the best shipping you know and right away here it will change automatically change the address to that specific order all right so just give it a second you know it will take you know maybe a second it was um, taking time to load all right see it's editing the shipping address right now it's gonna put in everything all right so because I couldn't put in an input a number it's supposedly to go through right away all right so let me just put a mock number here and save and ship to this address all right so technically it is it was supposed to come all the way to this page right away all right all you need to do is choose the payment method you know either by card or other payment method you know once you have done it once you know it will automatically go through all the way all you need to do is just come here confirm and pay and you're good to go all right so one thing uh, is that after you know this order has been placed you know it will not automatically fulfill your order with the tracking number all right this is very important do note this is just placing your order from aliexpress all right so after a few days one or two days once the order has been shipped out you now the supplier will come back with to you with a tracking number all right this you have to use the manual fulfillment method all right or you can actually also use the csv method you know if you want to you know mass fulfill a lot of orders all right so both works but do note you need to manually fulfill them all right do not just uh, assume that once i've placed my order and you know, the customer will receive the tracking number and all that doesn't work it doesn't work that way all right so this is very important do know that all right so this is all uh, um on how to fulfill uh, orders on dropify i hope you know you guys can is, are able to make use of dropify to really fulfill orders really quickly from aliexpress all right that's all for this video i'll see you in the next one